What's up, Bird Gang? I'm Bright Wolf. This is Eagles Real Talk. Thank you for joining me. And there was some big news around the league, something that we've been waiting for. It's been getting closer to free agency. Free agency starts next week. So you knew some Deshaun Watson news would break eventually. And today, you know, they came out and they're going to be dropping all criminal lawsuits, but his civil suit is still ongoing. There's still 22 civil lawsuits. So there probably is going to be some type of disciplinary action from the league so i expect i expect him to still miss two to four games next year even if you know everything goes smooth as far as his off the field issues but with that said if you're new to the channel you know what you need to do you need to hit that subscribe button get down with ERT and also hit that notification bell so you know when I drop this daily Eagles content news rumors uh, daily uh, draft prospects all that so make sure to hit that subscribe button but back to the news of the day Deshaun Watson is probably gonna be traded within the next I want to say, you know, few days, you know, it's possible he could be traded over the weekend. It's possible he could be traded by the time you watch this video. That's how fast the news is going to start moving, especially in the NFL. But I think the Eagles, I think they're right in the mix. And as you know, Howie has been keeping his binocular eyes on this situation and has been following all of the Deshaun Watson news rumors very closely. I'm sure he has connections where, you know, he's getting, you know, if not weekly updates, but daily updates on what's going on with Deshaun Watson and his, you know, off the field issues and his status with the Texans. So I think the Texans are going to look to make a move very quickly. Right now, I'm, I'm thinking the three to four teams that are in the mix the most are the Panthers, the Eagles, the Steelers and the Seahawks. I think those are, are four teams who also, you know, they won a quarterback. Um, they're uh, willing to bring in and give up some assets. And this is where I fall on the Eagles because this is, you know, this is an Eagles channel. So I'm going to get straight into it. I think the Eagles may offer Jalen Hurts two first round uh, picks this year, one first round pick next year, a second this year, and a fourth next year. So let me repeat that. So it's a total of three picks this year and Jalen Hurts. So a two first and we have three. So we'd still keep one. So, um, you know, it's not bad per se. It's not ideally. I think a lot of Eagles fans are excited for the future and they want to use all three of those picks and possibly willing to either trade back or, you know, give up maybe one pick for a wide receiver, something like that. But from everything that I've gathered from Eagles Nation, the bird gang, is, you know, we would rather keep our picks. So as 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 far as the reaction goes on the internet, Twitter, YouTube, I'm thinking that um, people really want to keep Jalen Hurts. I think a lot of people would rather keep our picks and roll with Jalen Hurts for at least another year than give a big haul for this. But with that said, let's be honest, Eagles fans. If we get Deshaun Watson, you know, he is, uh, you know, he's a damn good quarterback for what for what it's worth. He's not my personal favorite quarterback. Um, uh, years past, I've been, you know, um, you know, on the edge. I mean, on the fence as far as like, you know, how I really feel about his game. There are parts of his game that I do really like. There are parts of his game that I don't really, you know, I don't really like. But with that said, he can slang the pill all over the field. So it would be interesting to bring him into Philly, but I just don't know. I, is he Philly? I, th I guess that's the question. You know, I think that's what Howie really needs to come come down with an answer. Is this guy really Philly? Is, you know, is he going to be embraced in the locker room with everything he's got going on? I don't know. Those are questions that, you know, he has to answer as far as, you know, offering, you know, these picks and possibly Jalen Hurts to the Texans. You know, t uh, uh, Jalen Hurts is a Texas boy. Um, I think I've heard him in interviews say that he lived close to Houston. So I think his family had some ties or they would go see uh, Texans games. So that would kind of be cool for him, maybe if he was to get traded. Um, so how do you feel about the news that, you know, his charges were dropped, his criminal charges were dropped and that he's possibly on the move 
any day now, especially with free agency approaching next week. I think it starts on March 16th, if I'm not mistaken. So let me know in the comments. And if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. This is just a quick update on the Deshaun Watson ongoing situation and where he, you know, stands right now. And he's definitely going to be out of Texas any day now. So be on the lookout for that. I'll be dropping a video as soon as it happens. Who knows? He could be rocking midnight green, you know? So let's see what happens in the next coming days. Make sure to hit that subscribe button. I'm Bry Wolf signing out. This is Eagles Real Talk. Keep it real always.